it's Mark Lori. It is a YouTube video for June 8th. We're glad you're watching us and we're glad you're staying with us. 3,708 meals distributed. We will be distributing meals throughout the week at our normal time and our normal procedure. I'll give you more updates on meal delivery after this week, near the end of the week. High Park School has COVID testing and you can sign up for a free COVID testing. It's a throat swab. It's between 11 and 1. You can dial 278-4496. 278-4496. Niagara Falls Memorial Medical Center will answer. Schedule your appointment. Uh, if you're interested in PPE, the county will be at the traffic circle at Niagara Falls High School. 11 to, uh, 11 to 1. They might even be there a little earlier on Thursday, so please avail yourself. Tomorrow at uh, 7 o'clock, channel 1302 Spectrum, you'll see our sports award show. Tune in. Um, if you have medication that's still being held in your child's school and you want to pick it up, you must make an appointment with your principal or school nurse. Please call the school, make an appointment. After next Monday, that med medication that's left behind will be properly uh, destroyed and discarded. So please make sure you make an appointment to pick up any medication you may have in the school. Let's talk about the school board election and budget vote. The governor has extended the date of the school board and election and budget vote. You have until tomorrow to drop it off here at the Board of Education. That's Tuesday. If you uh, don't meet that deadline, you can still mail it and we will receive and accept your ballot until next Tuesday, June 16th. Bring it here if you'd like, but only through tomorrow. If not, put it in the mail. There is a postage paid envelope in the massive envelope that you received and you could send it in. The U.S. Postal Service will deliver it. That's after tomorrow. You cannot drop it off here any longer. The school board meeting has been postponed a week because of that decision by the governor to postpone the election. So the school board meeting will be June 17th. The Public Library has a number of great offerings this summer. Go to their webpage, public, Niagara Falls Public LIB.org. Check it out. Wednesday, Narcan Training and Narcan Distribution at Abbott, 11 to 1. Just like we do all of our events at schools, face coverings, and you're able to go to Abbott and get Narcan and be Narcan trained. It doesn't take much, and you may save someone's life. Um, Back to our school board election and budget, please note that we have answers of questions you may have on the school budget on our website. You can call myself, Mr. Jerizzo, or Ms. Holiday, the leaders of our business office, if you have any questions about the budget. It's a yes or no vote. I can't tell you which way to vote. I can tell you, however, there is no tax increase for another year. There is also uh, no program or people layoffs. And uh, we'd ask you to ask more questions of the budget if you're not sure how to vote. Finally, and very importantly, this Saturday is our graduation parade. It's not a graduation parade. It's a class day parade. Graduation comes later in the month. This is a class day parade. It starts at Dwyer Arena on the campus of Niagara. That's where the cars will, will assemble. There'll be judging and prizes that will be given away at the end. We'll start at Dwyer. They'll go down Lewiston Road to College Avenue where they'll turn left, down College, under the viaduct, down, uh, down past the old factories. They'll turn right on to High Park Boulevard, all the way down past High Park School and Gaskill, all the way down to Buffalo Avenue where the cars and the parade led by our police will make a left turn, ending up at LaSalle Prep, which has a large parking area so the cars can uh, turn around and be received. We're asking everyone to line the streets. We understand it'll be a nice cool day, sunny, I'm predicting. Get your blue and gold on. Get a noisemaker, get a sign, get a horn, anything to cheer these kids on. These are 400 of the best, the very best uh, in our students. They deserve 20 minutes of your time. Get out there and let's make it a great community parade. We're so proud of them and we want to show our appreciation. Other than that, social distancing, hand washing, the soap and water, not just hand sanitizer. Let's go soap and water today. Let's call somebody you haven't talked to in a while, check on them and say, how are you doing? Let's be positive and, and, and proactive in what our thinking and what we're doing. 
and let's stay uh, in tune with the Niagara Falls School District. We appreciate you very much. Thank you.